I'm gonna start something called uh, Pleasing Everybody Music, to where I'll drop this genre, then I'll drop me really rapping, then I'll do entertaining music, then I'll do strip club music, then I'll do like kids music. Like they say, like you can't please everyone, but I'm gonna try to be the first. From this age up, you can think about other things, and then from this age down, you can think about candy. <laughs> like, you know, so it's like, it just works universal, you know? So everybody can listen to it, it's fun. You just use your imagination. That's what type of artist I am. Like, I paint a picture, you know, painters paint on canvas, I paint in your mind. The concept of, it, of the video is basically like house party theme, uh, like Tupac's I Get Around kind of like thing. Uh, me and this girl Snapchatting back and forth. It's like my little interest for the party or whatever. And I keep running into these this temptation and like I'm trying to, um, you know, meet up with her and I'm trying to find her in this big house. And um, I run into girls pillow fighting with like half naked. Then like I run into this girl in the tub and there's a girl in the shower. And I'm just like, <laughs> I'm about to do. And I'm texting her and I'm trying to look, but looking at the same time, like, you know, yeah. So we finally meet up and we just get out of there. Like, you know, but um, yeah. Anything that's popping at the moment, you have to be involved. It's like you can't beat somebody, you join them. If anything helps. They're all big, huge, you know, platforms that people go to and watch. They're, they're great people, and if they feel like your song is good enough to be with them, then that just really says something. We all need someone or that one thing that helps us get to where we need to be at. We need all that social media. Sometimes it's horrible, sometimes it's great. <laughs> you, can't, you can't beat it. And nowadays, like, Fans are like children, so once they figure out who you are, they're like, wait, do we hate him or do we love him right now? And then they find out, oh, we hate him, so it's like, I don't like that song. So I, it's good for them to, you know, hear the song and, like, as their own person, not thinking social media-wise, um, to think like, dang, that was some, that saves a Gemini? And I'm like, yeah. <laughs> and then they see the video and they were like, dang, I was asleep. So it's, it's, it's always a blessing to hear that. Yeah, it's gonna be all types of different stuff. It's gonna be lyrical stuff, it's gonna be fun stuff. Anything you can think of is going to be in there. I'm working with um, Jeff Vaughn and Mike Karen, so you never know what they'll tell me to do. Uh, P.E.B., pleasing everybody. <laughs> so, I just made that up just now. <laughs> A lot more music is gonna be dropped this year, though. I've been holding out, because I didn't wanna be, I feel like I, I need to be like kind of like a red shirt, and just sit out for a little bit. And then I'm gonna start the year fresh and just let everybody know that I'm still here. Cause I've been doing a lot of stuff behind the scenes. So people are like, oh, I haven't heard Sage Gemini in a while. I'm like, yeah, you have, you just don't know it. You know, your favorite rapper is somebody I wrote for. I probably wrote that song.